And ba-boom, here it comes. The, the Valentine's Day stuff, the Regal Dragon Masters, a whole bunch of stuff that's supposed to launch. A lot more than that. There you go. Blowing up the Valentine's Day stuff. Remember Chicago? Fate. Kismet. No, I don't remember Chicago, Paula. You got me drunk. <sighs> okay, is it recording now? Okay, it's... Okay, when we're finally recording here. As you can see... You've, you've missed all my, my lead up to the explanation from buying this Roosevelt and upgrading it here in my office. I'm not going to do the respray. Not really that big a difference. That's a little bit better. We are turboing the whole thing up. For more romance here. Light smoke. All right, exit to ground. Let's see how it looks. Challenge complete. Modify a vehicle at Benny Lee's. Okay, well, we, I guess that counts. Does the red light take away from the, the classic kind of paint job here? Or does it just make it that much more romantic? All right, let's start the chili ad run, and then I'll get into all the things I said when I wasn't recording. How's that sound? Chili ad hot lap root. It's the chili ad hot lap root. I don't know if this is gonna work. I guess I should say hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight, because. Uh, I think I lost the intro there because I thought I was recording, and I was not. If I've said it twice, well then I've said it twice, and that's... I'm turn it off for now. But I have a Roosevelt Valor. I have a couple Roosevelt Valors, one on each car. Nice car. Uh, it was one of those Valentine's exclusives, and I got it back in the day. But once you bought it back in the day, that and the Roosevelt, you could get them pretty much whenever you want. So I did sell off my Roosevelt. Here we are. Never thinking that it would be part of the great, uh, the great FOMO panic of 2023. This is completely removed now. And the only place to get it is today at Simeon. Well, this week at Simeon. I guess they'll probably bring it back to next Valentine's Day. And so now, even though I now have only one parking space, ouch! I wanted to get this because I think this is a relatively rare car. And when you consider that they've got the red wheels, and those are the stock wheels. Not the normal way you'd get them. This car ends up turning into something a little bit special, in my own opinion. Certainly a rare vehicle. Certainly a good car for Chiliad. I'm not so sure. This this probably will end badly. This doesn't have as much power as the, the Roosevelt Valor. Or as much modification kind of options, although we didn't really take any because we're, we're 
taking it like we've just gotten a rare car that you know off the street kind of thing here custom built by a rock star I wonder if there's a spoiler after like if you put the tire on the back does that become a spoiler I didn't really even see any option for that we'll look at it when we get back deftly avoids the tree I'm not feeling a lot of momentum here. I'm feeling a little slippy slidey. Okay, let's take up a little bit of an angle to maintain momentum before we turn it straight up and just go for it. This is the hump that gets them all. If it's going to get got. Come on, baby, shift down. That's rev limiting. Come on, no, no, don't, don't do this to me. Come on, you're so close. Take it at an angle. And then at another angle. Didn't I get red smoke? That's just dirt. It can't do it. So the regular Roosevelt cannot make the hot lapper, although I'll bet you the Valor could. Darn it, we were so close there. This isn't going as well even as last time. What if we work this? No. It's just not an option. Alright, we gotta cut across here. I don't think we're gonna make it anywhere over there. I think it's go all the way back down and take the back route. Glad we didn't explode there. Glad, glad we threw armor on this. Ah, the good old days of cars, when the trunk was an actual trunk. Did you ever think about that? There used to be a trunk on the back of the car, and then you say, well, that's the trunk. See that? It's built in. You don't have to make it fancy. This is before those kind of fancy days, and it's the old kind of fancy days, where it's just really fancy. It's a fancy dancy car. Not that way. No, I couldn't. I'm gonna go up this way. It will be interesting to see if, if that one really awkward turn can it make it on the path. There are several awkward turns. I think if we keep it on the path, it should be okay. So if you found yourself so somehow, and so this is the awkward turn right here. Handled it well, very good. So if you were to find yourself in some bizarre situation where you had a fully modified Roosevelt in a G-Fred, this would be the way to, to go. Don't try and do the hot lap route, because it's not a hot lap in car. Although the Valor might be able to do it. Valor's got a little bit more and this almost made it. We want to retry this with the Joker and see if... Uh, I did have my Joker mobile out. Which is my Roosevelt Valor, which I was considering repainting because I don't really use it very much as a Joker mobile. If I'm doing something psychotic in game, I usually invoke the Lemonade Man and it's my own character, and then uh, 
use one of the yellow vehicles or something like that. But I don't generally play the game that way, so that doesn't even come out very much. So the Joker, the Joker mobile is like good for car shows. And like how, for how long until you get blown up. That's, you know, pretty much it. But this particular Roosevelt now with the, the stock wheels are custom red. I don't know, if you switched it from stock and back to stock, would they still be red? Maybe not. You could screw up the car. This makes you wonder, do I want to do like some kind of version of this with... Do I want to just get two of these? What's the point of that? Are we going to save the space for the rusty one, Rusty Jack, the second character? Or do I want to do one with like... Mercenary muscle wheels or something, or high end stuff that won't match the wheels on the fenders. Let's, we'll, 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 we'll take a look at this car. I mean, right now, the, the nice thing about this week is if we were to screw it up and somehow lose a special color, we would just buy another one because it's only half a mil. I'd gotten this to 212 million and a half or something like that, so just coast. Coast it down. No, 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 no. Come back here. Not this. Not this way. No. Get, get to the ground. Come on. We're just flying. Flying and rolling and sliding and exploding. I really expected it to go boom there. Hey, came back on its wheels without any direction. Yeah, there you go. Cannon handle the train. No, we're not gonna we're not gonna do a head-on with the train. I don't see the train yet. Is it coming? Are we beating the train? Well that is weird. Where's the train? Do we not get a train because we set uh, traffic to off? Because I just wasn't going to deal with traffic. Hmm. Or is it just time? Is there going to be a train in my face at any moment? Or is the train in vain? I mean, this is, we don't really keep track of times around here, so I mean, it's not like it's critical. We already know it's it's a suboptimal defect card because it couldn't do the hot lap room in the dry. It's a good looking car, though. Have the red lights on to lower the center of gravity a little bit. That's what they, how they say it works. I don't know. I don't know for certain. I have to trust what I see on the internet. This is Probably not a meaningful thing, but hey. All red lights for uh, Valentine's Day. There you go. I don't so I mean, the rest of the run is fine. It's a nice car to drive. Um, I don't think it's real fast. In case you're curious, I've already recorded my uh, my Valentine's Day racing special before buying this, so this car will not be featured. Maybe in a future effort. No, oh, no, 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 don't get stuck. Well, I thought right before the checkpoint we were gonna completely choke. Do a barrel roll and lose 
the door. Choking is still an option. I feel like I have to, just because of the point of discussion, take the Joker up there. But not immediately. In this video, but not immediately. Let's do what we normally do here and take another quick look at this. There's a red tire smoke. Added for love. Manage vehicles. That's not it. Vehicle preferences. All the doors. Look at that engine. I mean, that's just great. It's a 12 cylinder. You'd think you'd have a little more beef to it. 12 cylinders, but it's an old 12 cylinder. And again, those are the stock tires, the stock, stock wheels with the custom color pattern on them. I think this is a, I mean, this is just how they all came. Back in the day, I don't remember them being that way. Look at the look at the wood grain on that. That's that's worth a look inside. Look at that. That is nice. It's beautiful. Well, let's do this while we have some. Some doors open and I'm doing this the slow way because I could have just done this. Play job, my job. Let me show you the Joker. And we'll see if the Joker can take it up the hill. I have done this before, but why not? I say why not. Let's leave the traffic. Now, should we put on medium just to see if we get the train? Hey, why not do science, right? We're all about science here. There it is, the custom Roosevelt Valor. Now, this has a lot more, a lot more customization available to it. Obviously, it's a bit more powerful. As you can see, I have a theme. It's got a different engine note, I think. How are we beating the train? Yeah, there is a train, so you have to have traffic turned on, I think. To get the train, although we don't really know. It could be blind luck. <clears throat> when I built this, I thought I'd use it for like weird heists or something like that. You know, you do an actual whole Joker thing, but that became again, I don't know what footage I've lost here, so maybe I'm repeating myself. But I uh, I generally use the lemonade man for that kind of stuff when I do it, and I hardly ever do it. But, you know, I am fond of the car, and I don't have enough parking to get another Valor and do it up the way I think I might want. So maybe we'll, we'll wind up respraying this at some future date for funsies. So I can always put it back this way. Alright, that, that was awkward.
it would be interesting to change these back to stock and see if like the, the wheel color tracks the primary or something or secondary I forget which is which honestly I'm not feeling a lot I know this car is more powerful but I'm feeling like it's not doing as well that's my my gut feeling on it. It doesn't seem. All right, we're still going. Let's see what happens. All right, so we lost it there at this point. All right, so it is doing better. It's doing well enough. Yep. Now that's the difference between the Roosevelt and the Roosevelt Valor. Standard run here going. Oh, we made the turn way too early there. So I don't know, would I use this car more if it wasn't tied to the niche of being a joker mobile. Should I make it more my own? Should I make it not the jokers? Is this too obvious a paint job? Too obvious a meme. Should I do this a little bit more sedate? Ow! Jump out of here from nowhere. In the full heat of the moment. In the heat of the night. Yeet! Oh dear. Roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it back. No, 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 no. Oh. Sad face. Very sad face. There's no way out of this. I. If I tried to do that, I couldn't. By the way, I've also got an entire set of garage stories uh, already recorded and edited and uploaded for a future date. And that Roosevelt will be and we'll have to do like a, maybe a little footnote video for changes since those. And this rate result will be in, but not that one. So. Hadn't really planned on buying any more cars for this character. Woo! All right, I thought we were stuck again, but all right, we're moving. I do like the Roosevelt and its Valor uh, and, and regular and Valor flavors. Did the train come or did we miss it this time because we already went down once? pulled the train. 
Looks like we're rolling. You gotta give this purple headlights at some point. There's the train! Oh dear. Well, sparks. Didn't even hardly do anything here, right? It didn't hardly do anything. The car is very robust. Yeah, I was thinking, because I'm looking at it, we want to replace the purple with blue and the green with white. Do it up like my my faction custom, like the car I drove in high school. And a few years of college before the engine decided to rupture itself. It wasn't even going that fast. I mean, again, it's the kind of thing where I, this one, because it's already been wildly repainted, we could just repaint it. We could get this back at any time. That's probably... I'm, I'm still too on the fence to, to go through with that yet, so that's going to be a, a topic for another day. Well, let's see. The other one did it in 11 minutes, and again, that was with no traffic. And this car has had one reset. One had a Chiliad disaster, the other had a reset. Hey, we, we took it up this section. That's nice. It's a definitely a better performing car. You're going to just have one Roosevelt. Have the Valor. Which I believe is available at Luxury Autos, but not on sale. I wonder if this was a freebie. Was there something like that where you could get this for freebie? I forget. And we did it about two minutes faster. Why wouldn't I like it? I made it. Okay. They should put us back in the other Roosevelt. Yep, there we are. Let's wind it back down here. I don't know if the if the the red under lights are working for me or not. I might revert this a little bit. The color of the love. Of course, the original Valentine's ride, which had had red and then went to yellow to match the headlights, was the Pigalle. It's funny how the sports classics end up being associated with romance. Honkity. I see a clean path.
It does like to do aerial maneuvers, doesn't it? It's just... And if you're watching this on or about Valentine's Day, Happy Valentine's Day. <coughs> I might put this up a little bit in advance of that. I'll just do it whenever it's ready. Because it is a matter of stuff being available. This is available down at Simeon's. I mean, we could go do that. Revisit that because that part, for whatever reason, did not get recorded. Wrong buttons are hit. Oh, there you go. What are we doing today? They were pulling the lights off. I don't like them. Yeah, there's not really a... Is that what you were looking for? That's what I was looking for. And then... Spend the 1500 put that back to normal, so it's just a regular car. Is there anything... There's no visual modifications at all. We've already lowered it. I don't imagine it's going to feel very much different. No. Nah. Let's slap a line up to uh, Simi Hans. Show it to you for sale. I'm starting to wonder, do I really need two of these? Because, I mean... Maybe it's worthwhile just to keep this on my main character. There's already a Valor. I can show it. We can, we can go look at the Valor. A little handbrake action there. go to Simeon's just to look around as we would have earlier when I bought the car and you can see lots of red, lots of valentine, lots of romance, all kinds of romance. People are considering romance. All these people shopping for romance and here it is as you would get it yourself. And again those are the stock wheels with the you know it looks like a grace red kind of thing or something along those lines. And if you look at it's 525000 which is on sale. Which it's not like you can, well, if you miss out, you'll miss out on the sale. You're going to miss out on it all together because you can't get it. It's a FOMO car. And for as much as I've been trying to embrace JOMO, <clears throat> the joy of missing out, which means that you take some time to yourself to not go crazy over fads and fashion. This is, this is an, I like this car. It's something that I did want to have. Especially if it has extra rare custom colored wheels. All right. Let's switch it up and take a look at the other one. Cause that's, that's a, that's a pretty wild beast. It's beastie in and of itself.
take it easy. Ah, here we go. See we're recording? Yeah. Now we're blowing up all of the the Valentine's Day stuff for this character. Most of which will never get used. Again, the car. Let's go get that other one. I believe it's uh, downtown. Weekly challenge complete. Complete the diamond casino heist one time. Huh? We have not done that or started that or anything this week. Did we get like 100k for that or? All right, that's that's just weird. We haven't even been to the uh, been to the arcade this week. That's just odd. Huh? All right, for a minute there, I thought I was wasn't gonna find it. Checking multiple garages. Here you go. Supercharged, old school dish wheels, all kinds of lights. See you later, plate. Done up in dark blue and orange, a little bit of hint of orange juice and toothpaste. We don't need to take it up chilly, I think it's gonna happen the same way as before. I'll make it. If I do want to zip down, I'm wondering. Let me see where I have some parking. Do I want to get a regular Roosevelt? I do it. Maybe this will keep the red. Keep the ultra rare red with the red custom wheels. Because you can't cover the wheels you know, on the side, so like they won't match if you don't if you put custom wheels on it. Just ruins the whole thing as far as a regular Roosevelt. This one's different. I think I have one in maze three. Looking at my notes from January 21st when I checked everything. Yeah, there it is. One right here. Well, we can always sell it if we change our mind, right? If we get buyer's remorse. Why not? I say why not. Because I'm thinking, if you just change out the tan, you can do a lot. What about a brushed metal and a silver kind of paint, you know? Gasoline green. All kinds of options. In some ways, it's a little bit of a waste, because I'm going to take one out. I'm going to take out this one. I mean, well, I mean, look at it. Just, just look at it. Cool. But, for as little as I can do with this one, like I'm just want, I just want to take it in and then see what happens when I change that tan to something else. And I don't want to do it with another one. I want to keep that one as stock as possible. Excuse me. Um, snacks? No. Full of snacks. Absolutely. All right, now it's time for some experimentation. Do the wheel shift color with the primary or secondary, as the case may be? We'll find out. 
There you go. Modify your vehicle. Okay, so it is metal. Oh, and the wheels do change. Okay, so they're tied to that color. That is interesting, and that gives me another thought. What if we kept this one as the stock one? And then modified that other one with the blue and white. That'd be best of all worlds, wouldn't it? Okay. Hmm. So I was thinking just about doing this as, you know, secondary color. And then put it up into like a silver. To go with the red. But I'm thinking, no, you know what? Watch this. We're, we're going to be switching back and forth here. Once this thing is fully revved up. They're bulletproof. No kidding. Light smoke on everything. Exit to garage three. Now, follow me on this. And yeah, I did all this again without recording, because I don't know why. Sometimes you hit the button and it works, sometimes it doesn't work. And that's just how we're doing this. But yeah, now it's recording. I don't understand. I did consider, and we'll, we'll blow some money here and we'll, we'll go back the other way. Did consider the possibility of what if we went with white on this. And then made the secondary the you know where is the uh, Saxon blue or Harbor blue? And it almost looks darker than it was before. Like where was the other? Like with this, with the secondary, you almost have to go with a mariner to get that kind of look. Like, And that looks good, and it does have kind of the, the blue roof like my other car used to have. But like the white wheels, they're somehow just not as cool as having those done up in blue. I don't know why, it's just me. So we're going to let that go. We'll go back to primary. There's Saxon, there's Mariner, Harbor. Mariner blue. And let's give it let's give it the diamond blue for pro lesson. Let's shine it up a bit. I think we're on point now. This is this is dialed in. For what I want it to be. Ties it in a little bit better with the garage, I think. A lot of, a lot of white vehicles. This had this had a lot of my uh, my wheeled warriors kind of color, color scheme here, the white and gold. And you can see it does kind of tie in with the other Eudora. I should just bring the Eudora down, put them next to each other temporarily. So you can see now. Where we're kind of heading with this. Very nice, very nice. It's, it may as well match the garage if it's going to mostly be a garage decoration anyway. Am I right? That's, that's how this is probably going to work out. But I like it. I'm glad we got it. And on that note, folks. 
Ladies and gentlemen, happy ha happy Valentine's Day. This is your Black Knight. Have a great night. Hey, 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 no. Don't be mean. We don't have to be mean. Because remember, no matter where you go, there you are. And I move things around so that uh, they can be together. Now I kind of want blue wheels on this one. Hmm. Let's, let's, let's leave, leave it be for right now. What do you say? We lost him.